Hello and welcome to Microsoft Excel 2010 applying a 3D or three-dimensional referencing that is summing the values across multiple worksheets brought to you by shift key solutions and I am Eric Ripley in this video to create a formula in the summary worksheet that totals the values for cell B3 from worksheet 2009 and 2009 sales and 2010 sales so let's look at this. We're here on the sum, and I'm going to go to cell B3, and I want to create a formula that totals the first quarter for the red hot chili chocolate. So if I come over to, to take a look real quick, 2009 worksheet, here is uh, in B3 the red hot chili chocolate for first quarter, and then 2010 in B3, same thing. This is just not formatted yet. So I want to add those two up, 43 and 23. I come to the summary, and I could type it in there. I could type the total, but then it wouldn't be dynamic. It wouldn't change as this information changes. So I want to create a formula in here. That formula is going to begin with an equal sign, as always. From here, I'm going to do sum, and then press tab. Now here's where... I want to go and identify these other cells. I'm going to click on the 2009 sales and then click right here into cell B3. And then I'm going to do a comma. By pressing comma or adding a comma there, it's saying and, meaning I'm going to add something else. Now I'm going to go to 2010 and then click B3 here. And from here, I simply press equal, or enter. When I do, it enters that formula. Now if I come back to this cell, I can look at my formula and it's pretty straightforward. It's telling me sum 2009 sales, cell reference B3, and 2010 sales, cell reference B3. Pretty simple. Folks, that, that'll complete our exercise. Thanks for joining me and I hope this was helpful.